All right, let's just kind of talk about what we ran through today. Um, run down of the steel, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Cool, 10th string. So let's figure out where the regular triad notes are in this open E ninth tuning. So we have B, E, G sharp, B, E, G sharp. So that's 10, 8, 6, and get used to these grips. 10, 8, 6. 8-6-5, Cool, once you're used to that, um, and you know, arpeggiate them. And so on, cool. Let's go to the eighth fret, that's our C note. Cool, if we actually take this E note on the uh, fourth string, which is an important string to visualize the instrument on because we're gonna walk up E, F, G, A, B, C, D, E to finish out the first 12 frets, but we're gonna go to C for now at the eighth fret. We're gonna stick in the key of C for a second. We're gonna go string six, five, four, cool? For all these chords. So we're gonna have C, A minor, F, G, or in the key of C, one, minor six, four, and five. Cool. So free falling. One, four, four, one, five. Now to get that four chord, well, one chord's no pedals, no knee levers. Four chord, A and B pedals down. Five chord, two frets higher, also A and B pedals down. So get that song down. Now, if you want to make it countrified, check this out. Plug the C chord, mute it, then while it's muted, hit the B pedal on the B pedal alone, and then strike all three strings. Let the A pedal come down. Let's hit that move again. B pedal down, A pedal up. That's your typical kind of pedal steel sound. So C. A and B down for G, or five. 